hi guys welcome back so today in this video we shall be discussing about the integration of razor pay with flutter so what is razor pay so razor pay is nothing but a payment gateway solutions that deals with mobile payments all those stuff so what are payments it acts an intermediate between the customer and the bank so what are payments you need to make you can have a razor pay as a intermediate for that payments so if you want to have an overview kindly please check out the razor pay official site okay so uh, let me just help you in how to integrate that razor pay in flutter app so in this the razor pay they provide their own ui so you don't need to develop it from the scratch so everything is pre-built on their side so you just need to pass the values and all that simple steps and that is what your part in this first you need to create a login in razor pay site so kindly check out the razor pay official site and create a login once you are done you are good to go with the coding part so after you are done with the login uh, in the path spec you just need to add this dependency which is the razor pay and the score flatter okay once you have done this you also need to update your build or create out that is the android in the android folder you can say that app folder you will be having that build.gradle file in that you should have the minimum sdk version as something 21 would, would be nice and no problem so just stick on to that okay so once you are done with this pre initial setups you will be good to go with the coding part okay so let's get started with the coding part as uh, usual first let me have a variable say it is an integer variable which is the total amount what i need to pay okay initially set it as zero for now okay once you're done with that you just need to create the platform constant method channel which is the razor pay underscore flutter okay then you just need to have an object a reference for razor pay okay let me have this razor pay okay nice once you are done with this let's go to the ui part that widget part so um, here as usual as the scaffold let us have an app bar which is the app bar of and take the title as const text of what is we need to have a uh, razor pay or is razor pay payments okay once it is done let's get rid of that app bar align it and after that app bar let us have a body okay so once say the body let me have it as a centered widget within which i will be having a child the child takes the column widget so column as usual takes the children widget okay children widget okay align it nice okay inside the children widget let me have the main axis alignment Oh, before that let me have the main axis alignment this is the main axis alignment dot center okay 
after that inside that children widget let me have a text form field which takes the keyboard type as keyboard type okay sorry let's take the keyboard type as import type dot numbers because we will be giving only the amount so which is an integer that is the number so just have the keyboard type as number itself okay so decoration if you want can give let me give it as input decoration with hint text word me enter enter the amount okay after that inside the on change let me have a takes the value okay i will be setting the state where i will be updating the total amount to the value what you have entered so it is integer so you need to pass it using the num okay parse of value what you have typed okay after that yeah, let's get out of the text form field now let me give a sized box box of height cola so let me give it as 25 yeah so give it as 25 okay 25 all right after that let me have a button this is the raise the button in which on press i will be having a function named open checkout which is a function i will be defining later so this button take the child which is the text okay let me say it as pay okay right align it so i haven't defined it so it's just like that okay once you're done with this so i have just created a text form field to get the input number values that is the amount what you need to transfer and a button within which you will be redirect to the razor pay payment solution okay after that you need to have init state okay so the init state is where you will be writing the handlers that payment handlers okay let's write it here uh, it will write okay wide in it state within which we will be having the handlers okay we will be using razor pay for to razor pay okay now it's time to write the handlers which is the razor pay dot on of is the razor pay razor pay dot event underscore payment success first okay then I'll be deducting to handle payment success method right so just copy this paste it here you just need to change this success as error then I will be rewriting to 
handle payment error fine next is event underscore event underscore payment external valets using some paytm valets or something like that so in that case i will be rewriting to external valet okay so after that any state let's just just disclose that methods okay super dot dispose fine where well, is the razor pay that reference dot clear all right This one the primary function comes in. That is the open check code what we have used here. So let's just check out. Fine. Open checkout of just an async method. Okay. Where options within the options let us define the parameters okay options will take the key so the key is nothing but once you have created a login in your razor pay you will be provided with a key so you can just copy it and paste it here as of now let me have it as empty base but you need to give it okay you can just inside your profile dashboard page you will be having the option of seeing your keys so you just need to give it over here okay after that key let me give the amount so the amount is what we defined earlier the total amount so it takes the input as something 0 0.00 so i just need to have it as a whole number so i just multiply it with the with 100 okay after that i'll be having the name all right which is you can give any names for your profile and uh, that is the company let me give it as my corp and you need to have a description description what you need to give is anything what you want to have as a subtitle like that in your ui okay inside the prefill uh, you need to give the contact okay contact you can give the mobile number so then you can also give your email ids all right so uh, as of now i am just leaving those as empty okay after that you need to have external so external something that valid what we define okay so double quotes in quotes doesn't matter right okay? so let me give it as external wallet as paytm okay once you're done just align it okay so after that just have to enclose that using the try right underscore razor pay dot open off the options okay then if it is so or any other appearance 
then we need to catch that properly so we'll just print it in the console what error has occurred okay after that you just you are just left out with the creation of that handle payment these functions okay now let's just define those functions here so as this y underscore what you are defining is handle payment success okay which takes the payment success response okay within which I will be writing is a better toast so for flutter toast you need to import this you need to add this dependency flutter toast okay for your reference flutter toast dot show toast message or what message you need to show okay so it is success and response dot payment id also okay similarly you shall define the remaining methods also just this time it takes the payment failure response okay which returns uh, within at a toast dot show toast of what message is it is an error message okay so the error message will be displayed along with the response what you get as from the laser pin response dot code dot to string of okay then you can also add the response message okay error message and the response message all right align it so only one more method to go all right just copy it this time some external valid response valid response as usual the flutter toast dot so toast message award messages Wallet. So we have just done the payment using the external wallet. All right. Along with the response message wallet name. What wallet you have used? Okay. Let's just align it. So you are just green to go with the payment app. So the razor pay will just have a UI of their own through which you will be processing the payments. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned till the next update. Bye.